Welcome back everyone. Today we're using Mega Mawile in National Decks, continuing our Using Every Mega series. This team is bulky offense and has some weird sets like Taunt Lando, as well as Future Sight Scarf Lele, so we'll see if we can take advantage of all of that, but... I mean, here my best Pokemon is my Toxapex. I mean my Mawile, I just have to Thunder Punch Pex is what I'm trying to say. Well, this isn't great. <laughs> I definitely don't like Ditto against uh, my team because they can just scout every single set. They're not going to Magma Storm here because they're a stall player, so let's just literally go Landorus. They might Rocks, but they'd probably just switch. Oh, they used their Terra immediately. Well, these are like always Choice Scarf, right? Let's double Heatran yeah, on the Tangrowth, and then let's get up Rocks here. They shouldn't Earthquake. Anyway, so I'm hoping I can hit this. Maybe they're Assault Vest and don't care. Okay, this is actually great for me. I can Earth Power here. And if they're not Shed Shell, I can Earth Power again. I think they are based on how... No, they're not. Okay, cool. No Shed Shell. I will take that any day. But what I have to do here is... I mean, like, Blissey can wall me, right? I can Toxic it now, but... I'll Toxic it so it's forced to switch out at some point. Like, I don't want to switch out on a Toxic, right? That would be bad. They would have Thunder Wave, though. They don't, like, run Toxic ever anymore. So I catch Tangrowth so I can Magma Storm again. But it just lets Blissey in, so, like, what's the point? Let's just go Heatran anyway. I wish this Heatran had Taunt, but it has Toxic. I mean, Toxic is fine too, but... Like, against Stall, Taunt is definitely what you want to be using. Yeah, I was about to say, what are you thinking about, dude? You obviously go out into this. Let's go Mawile here. I think I just want to knock off. They go Corviknight. I don't think I'll be faster, but let's Thunder Punch. Okay, I am. So now they're gonna go... Tangrowth, probably. Yeah, and... Landorus is okay, like with Taunt and stuff. Lele is not too good. I don't think they're gonna click Earthquake here. They're gonna click, like, Knock Off or Giga Drain. Let's go Heatran. Anyway. If I had Psy Shock here, it would be so over, but I don't. So this is the plan, right? We go this, then we go this. And we basically just say, hey, you either take this player off or somebody has to take a player off plus a future side, which doesn't happen. Which is, yeah, so now I win using Lele probably. I have to be careful not to get Sliver swept, but I can still Terra and they can't. This is like very okay. <laughs> I think they were hoping for something else, but yeah, let's U-turn here. And like they might go Dondozo. Yeah, they want a U-turn too. I can still come in, which is like the important thing. Yeah, I go U every time. I just click Moonblast, right? I don't even click Psychic. No, I can just click Psychic. What am I talking about? I can't Terra because the way the way this works is if I Terra, then I can get Reverse Swept by Tapu Lele, so. In fact, I almost want Tapu Lele to be dead. Okay, we crit them, which is nice. Let's sack this as they Moonblast. Terra, Ghost, Ditto, Tapu Lele. I mean, like, I can obviously just win off a speed tie, but that's not what I want to go for. I'm just debating who's better, and I think I have to go Zama here and just Terra. And like Crunch. Yeah, and now we win. So that's gonna be the stall game. We dismantled this team, but it's kind of annoying. <laughs> yeah, GG, man. And uh, yeah, that'll be that. Let's go ahead and get another game. Now we have to beat Mega Diancie as a potential lead matchup, which not a lot of my team does. <laughs> I can lead a Landorus, but like, Urshifu is such a threat that I don't really want to have to switch on it. I could always tear a dragon, but then like, I'm tearing a mon that's walled by Corviknight, so... 
It's like not even a good position either way. Let's lead Ogre Pawn. So like after the Omega, this is a speed tie. Which is why I think they're going to go Corvin Knight. So I kind of want to SD and then Ivy Cudgel, but it's not worth it. Let's just Ivy Cudgel. And we just knock that out. Okay, so that's a really good start. I don't know why they risk that. This most likely wants to Scarf U-Turn if they're bringing it in. Well, you're never clicking Surging, so let's go Landorus. Yeah, I think they're Scarf and want a U-Turn. Now they're going to go either Corviknight or Ogre Pawn. They go Ogre Pawn. I could Terra, but it still feels wrong. I think I'd do it, though. Just so I have this against them, you know? Like, I don't have to deal with that. They're going to go into a Steel type here, but that's fine. Okay, they just decide to sack it. Yeah, I think I'm fine this game, even though I use my Terra. I still have enough stuff to break this. I think this is going to be a Mega Charizard Y because they want to give the Sun Boost to Great Tusk with Protosynthesis. Let's try to Psychic through this team, I think. Hatterene is the resist, and I have to be worried about Sneasler. So Intimidate Defensive Lando is going to help, but not if they have Terra Flying. This is a great lead, obviously. The thing is, do I want to... Ivy Cudgel right now, or do I want to keep Terra? I think against this sort of team, I have to like just go for it. So let's just Terra Ivy Cudgel. Like I, I want to start getting kills. And like even if they go Rilla Boom here, I don't care. They still die to this. Why did they? Okay. Well, I don't have to worry about Terra this entire game. I think this this team's entire plan is just like click setup, right? That's what it's looking like. So let's deny the Sneasler here. Like, they obviously can't go out into it now, so... Okay, this is gonna have Ice Spinner. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm just gonna get another kill using my Ivy Cudgel. Well, not a kill, but it'll do a lot to Rilla. Wow, that actually didn't do a lot. I thought it would do more. Yeah, why does that do so little, man? Okay, I think I keep Landorus at this percent. And go who though? Like nobody wants to come in other than Landers. U Turn's not great, but like I do like it to like with Wall Hatterene because I'm Spadef. Okay, I don't think I'm faster, this is the problem, but I want a defog. Okay, perfect. I got the defog off. That's all I needed. Well not all I needed, but it's a good start. Let's psychic here. Why is that just like Max Bedev, dude? What? Okay, I, I want to go Heatran. Nuzzle, that's so annoying. If I was real, I'd click Rocks, but I'm not. <laughs> like, let's just Magma Storm and see what happens. I'll try to Rocks now. Okay, we get it off, which is great, because now this thing either has to Roost or die to Rocks next time it's in. Best play could be Ogre Pawn. Like, realistically, I want to go Great Tusk, but let's go Lele here. And let's just Psychic. I don't think they'll switch this out because of Rocks, yeah, so I don't have to Moonblast and, like, make an overprediction or anything like that. Grassy goes up. Do I still think I need Ogre Pawn? Not really. And it does stop Sneasler... No, maybe not under rain. I mean sun. But they would want a grassy glide here, right? Do I want to go Zamazenta? Probably. But that also is just set up fodder for Sneasler. So do I have to sack Lele to not lose? Okay, they decide to go Hatterene, which is fine. And they're just going to nuzzle again. All this guy does is click nuzzle. Yeah, like he just wants to para-hax me. It's very clear. I'm going to play rough, obviously. I can live one Mystical Fire, but I'm just going to get full parried, probably. Maybe not. Okay, that's great, because they can't go Sneasler. Oh, they're just going to... Come on, dude. If this game plan works, like, it works, right? Whatever. Yeah, like, come on, dude. What is your, what's your plan there? Is that actually it? 
and they leave the game. They don't even like forfeit. Well then, well, obviously I win this. Let's go ahead and get another game. Well, this is just straight up screens and four setup mons and probably a choice scarf Lele. Yeah, that's what this has to be. How do I want to not lose? <laughs> I always like to lead off with a potential rocker because people want to click taunt, right? Not this guy, apparently. No, get those out of there. Now you're going to click... Uh... Oh, okay, that's fine, because I taunted, so you can't, whatever comes in can't set up. So it's probably going to be Celesteela, right? Oh, they want to go Lele now? That's fine, I'll go Heatran. This is annoying. I have to Toxic. And then I think I can take this hit and get a Brox, but Lele is going to be a threat then. Yeah, that's just a problem. Okay, wait, 55. That's too much, actually. I was hoping I could take another, but it doesn't look like I do. So they get the kill. Can I deal with this? Like, at all? How much does my team take from this? Like, does anyone want to live? Does anyone have a... No Terra, they resist Shadow Ball. Can Landorus take a Shadow Ball? Actually, Store Power is going to come out. This is really hard. Like, maybe Zamazenta can live if I... Well, they would Store Power here, right? So let's Terra Steel Crunch. Okay, that's how I deal with that, but it burned my Terra. And I don't know if that's gonna be good enough to win this now. Yeah, because they go Celesteela and I just lose to Autotomize, right? Like, I'll hit this, whatever, but it's not gonna help. Yeah, they're just gonna Autotomize sweep. Maybe Lele outspeeds, depending on their set. Okay, they get a boost. Flamethrower, huh? This can't touch it. This will die to air slash. I have to go Lele. And... I guess I Psychic. I am faster, and I can live. Okay, that's all that mattered. Like, they can go Grimmsnarl here. I don't care, but they don't. Now... <laughs> Dude, playing this, like, type of team is so hard without Sucker Punch on Mawile, but I understand why the team doesn't have it because of... Mawile, like, I mean, because of terrain, right? The Landorus is good now. I don't think Ogre Pawn is, so I'll go Ogre Pawn to sack. We'll confirm there's Scarf here, but I'm, like, 99% sure they are. Okay, I actually got the hit off, and maybe they're not Scarf then. Speed Quark. Can I beat Speed Quark? Probably. CC's there. If I go Landorus and sack it, I don't know if I beat Haxorus after it D-dances, but it's never going to get to D-dance, right? So do they sack Lele here? But you don't want this without the speed quirk. Why does that take it with minus one do? That's crazy to me. Wait, actually, I think I see what I do. I go Lele now. Actually, no, I go Mawile now. Force and Haxorus, go Landorus to Intimidate and try that. Because I need Mawile to not lose to potentially Scarf Lele, right? Wait, they go Lele now. I think I'm good. Like, I don't think I lose. Hits me there. But, but like, you have to Earthquake, right? Okay, Terra Steel, but like, I have a <laughs> Landorus. <laughs> That can earthquake this now so yeah they don't get any sort of crits or crazy shenanigans like that and we are going to beat this team but that was a, a scary game for sure there were a lot of times i could have lost and uh yeah let's play again all right this regenerator core is only going to be broken by mega mawile and maybe taunt lando depending on what sort of terror they have on pokemon because i can earthquake spam but like earthquake doesn't damage all of my mullet too much so I think the best lead for me is going to be Lele. Yeah, okay, I like this a lot. Do I want a Focus Blast? Not particularly. They just have to pivot Sloking. These usually do have Earthquake, but I'll Heatran. 
Okay, seeing that they have Yawn, I'm just gonna get up rocks and let them put them on to sleep. Like, unfortunately, yeah, they're gonna spin here. This is really annoying. <laughs> yeah, because now I can't get up rocks. I see what this team is trying to do. Maybe Heatran wasn't the Monta that get put to sleep. Okay, luckily they let me Psychic that. That's Assault Vest though, why does it take that hit? Like so well too. And I can't let it ever get a Wish Pass to it, that's gonna be really bad. They wouldn't Ice Beam here. Yeah, they, all these people do is click Chili, so let's just play accordingly. I do 33. Defog, okay. I'm assuming this has a helmet, so I don't really want to like be here. <laughs> but it's just gonna flip turn, right? Yeah, like I, this guy only clicks momentum moves, so. Terra Dragon Toxic. Huh. Click that again, will you? I can't tear this, not when it's uh like in this position. This is like so annoying. I should be switching out actually. I think Encore has a few more turns, so. Okay, luckily I got in on Toxic, so that's really nice. Let's knock off here. Like, they're a dragon type, they shouldn't be staying in on player off. Yeah, okay, don't flame body if you have it, come on. Okay, cool. It was Choice Scarf, so I think this is gonna go for an interruption. I mean, Landorus can come in. If I were them, I'd click a fire move, not a ground move. Especially because even if Heatran comes in, like, you don't have to click flamethrower now you can just earth power it after so let's make some plays here let's go you and then go you there we go yeah i think i got that read correct because they don't all, they never flamethrower i mean earth power first it doesn't make any sense hollow comes in i don't like all of <laughs> wish well there's one thing I don't want, and it's them wishing into Quaquavel, so... Like, I don't care if Garchomp wants to get the wish, that's fine. I gotta start thinking about who's gonna be winning me this game. And the answer is Mawile, but I need to knock off this helmet. Wait, so they're doubling now, so they're willing to play it a bit aggressive. Okay, we got that. We got it right now. Now let's start playing and making plays. Actually, nope. I was literally gonna cancel and not do that. Yeah, I was thinking they just want to get up rocks in this interaction. And now, like, I'm in a really tough spot. We got that right, but I don't know if I break this team, dude. This team is really hard to beat. Let's go Landorus and try to defog. So who comes in here? The duck? The Allo? I hope it's the Allo. I want a defog. It's the Lele. Well, I got a sleeping Heatran, so... Uh, it's 18. I think that's Scarf. That should be Scarf. Oh, it's not, it's not even choice. Okay, good to know. Can I live whatever they're doing this turn, maybe? Nope. But I didn't take future side with anything, so that's nice. Let's go you now. I just knock off again. Okay, we got rid of the helmet. That's so good. I love that. And we knock it out. I think I'm like just in a good spot with this Mon right now. I mean, Garchomp is a scary mon, don't get me wrong. But I'm still out of range of Focus Blast from Lele. Out of range of anything Quick Wavel wants to do. 
So they can easily click a fire move now, unfortunately. Ogre Pawn, your time has come. I have several paths to winning, and they're I mean, Lele Mawaller is where it's going to kill everything, right? So... I shouldn't die to Flamethrower. If I do, then I lose, but... You know what? Should I tear the dragon? I'm not tearing anyone else, so... I mean, I could tear a dragon Earthquake. It's probably actually the better play here. Yeah, I'm very fine with this. I'll Earthquake spam. Because I need Garchomp dead for Mega Mawile to win. So if they're willing to sack this here, I need to not get high rolled or crit by Earthquake, and then I can maybe win. Okay, they could actually decide to get up Hazard, which is okay. Now now they go Lele. Wait, is this okay? Yeah, it is. I can still outspeed it using Zamazenta. Okay, that's crazy that they risk that. Why would you do that? I don't even know if Zamazenta kills it. And Mawile doesn't take Focus Blast from that range. So I think what I do is I go Lele, and I hope they let them hit me. <laughs> I mean, I, ho I hope they let me hit them. But they obviously go Slogan, because why would you not go Slogan, you know? Everyone wants to go into this Mon. It's crazy, dude. If I if I just had a bit more damage, I would win the game using uh, Zamazenta right now. But I don't think Stone Edge can kill. And also, I don't want to risk Stone Edge if I don't have to. Okay, it could, but it needs a really high roll. Ah, uh, what do I do? I need to get this roll, dude. That's the only way. Maybe I shouldn't have terrored Lando then. Okay, let's play for uh, ouch, you know? Like, okay, I'll knock off here. No, but this just leads into the same situation. I have to get the kill. Okay, yeah, they suck that to go Heatran, and I just have to, like... I mean, I could switch out. It doesn't help, though. Like, I still have to play this situation out. Yep, so I go you. I click CC. Not get burned, and... I mean, they might have Psychic. They might go for the Yawn, too, but... Like, they haven't seen Crunch. Maybe they'll throw. Either way, like, this is the role I'm playing with right now, and that's assuming they're not even a bulky Lele. Mm. Like, they can easily just... go Zamazenta, click Yawn. I mean, go Sloking, but if Z Sloking just dies right now, then it still comes down to that. Oh, Sloking doesn't take anything. Yeah, they win. Unless I crit here. So I have to Stone Edge. But yeah, they just win now. GG. I mean, I, I thought Sloking would take more from Crunch, honestly. So I should have always kept Terra, but then it would have made it harder for, like, Landorus in that situation. So, I mean, they, they played it well, but it was just a really unfortunate... I mean, the matchup wasn't even that bad. I was going to say unfortunate matchup. I think I could have done a few things differently. Let's play again. Okay, Mega Medicham team. Very weak to Lele Moonblast, so that's going to be a win condition. But I need damage on Ferrothorn, obviously. I don't want to give Medicham a free kill on lead. So let's go Ogre Pawn. I think I SD here. Because if they get up rocks, they either have to sack him on or give me the Ferrothorn, which opens up Lele. Oh, they're dick. <laughs> okay, well. I wasn't expecting Z immediately. But I guess looking back, this is the only likely Z Mon. That's really tough, but you know what? Let's go Landorus, not Panic and whatnot. And let's go for an Earthquake here. Then let's Defog. Then let's Earthquake. Then let's Defog. Okay, they locked Outrage, so... Lele. You know what? I'm just gonna focus blast. Okay, we hit anyway, but I uh I was a bit worried because I wanna get the damage on Ferrothorn as soon as possible. This is a really bad position to be in because here's the problem. I can go Heatran and they Volt Switch into Medicham and I am not in a good spot, right? 
But they click Hurricane. Okay, we're fine. So they're going to go Samurott or Alo, actually. This is would have been great. <laughs> mm. This is my switch in. But they have a whole Zapdos there just to deal. I still go it, but that's a really annoying miss. I can, Alamomola can even come in here if it wants. They wouldn't want to stay in though, so we hit that nice. Do you go Alo? Like, I wish this was toxic right now, dude. This, this would be such a free position. Wish. Into who? I guess just protect, right? Yeah, okay, we got that. I just want to toxic you, come on. Thank you. Like, I shouldn't have had to do that there, but it is what it is, right? Like, it's part of the game. You're gonna get hacked sometimes. Okay, so they, they finally recognize that they can't do this forever. And go Medicham. I sack Lando. Fake out. Zen, then I go you. Okay, they do go Pharaoh. And it's a lefties, interesting. I'm gonna go you here and knock off and see how they wanna react. Because I don't think they'll give me this, but how low is my team? Wow, we are, uh, we're gonna have to make some plays to win this, but, okay, that's a good start. In fact, I might have just won, <laughs> because they did that, <laughs> like, unironically. I think I just won with Moonblast. Why did they give me that? 49, 23, I, I think Zapdos dies, but I, I, can't, I don't have turns to play with with all these hazards on my field, so. Let's just, wait, they can Terra, right? No, they can't. They Okay, yeah, I forgot. They just tear it, which is why my knockoff did so much. That was like the one thing that could have worked out for me there, and it did. <laughs> yeah, they can't take Moonblast with anything, especially since... Wow, that actually did take it, and they sacked it. That's crazy. Yep, three turns, three mons that die. I mean, they don't die, but, like, they're low enough. Okay, I'll take it. Whatever. And now I switch out, come back in, and win. Wow, weird game, but we got it. Like, I don't think I was a very deserved win, but we got it. In hindsight, I should have focus blasted, but they did a great job at throwing that endgame somehow, so we'll take it, and now we have to beat an Alolan Ninetales as a lead. Wish I had Heavy Slam on Zamazenta, but you know what? It's okay, we can... Ogre Punch faster by a bit. Indeedy. Okay, so they want they want to prioritize making sure I can't click priority, which I don't have on this team, so that's really good. What do you go to? You just stay in and healing wish. Okay, so that's for later. This might have freeze dry, which is like but it's just gonna click veil, dude. They all click veil. Yeah, now I'm gonna encore them into veil and his deeps more. <laughs> Okay, but I actually don't want to stand, so I should have cudgeled. Actually, wait, this is going to be a Dragon Dance set. This is not going to be a, like a freeze dry type of set, I think. Is that a problem? Yeah, it is a Dragon Dance set because it's, it's screens, right? So it's going to be Dragon Dance. Do I need Landorus? No, not at all. Scale shots, okay, that's fine. And then spears, okay, good. So plus two speed, minus defense, Zamazenta comes in here and CCs them. Okay, so now the threat is Celesteela, which they're going to go out into. <laughs> I might have to hit Magma Storm, we'll see. Oh, they go Hatterene. To put up a second healing wish, what's the point of this? How do I want to react? I don't think I need to keep Zamazenta at this point. I would love to hit my moves. 
Hmm. Like, okay, in theory, Heatran beats these other two, but I need to hit Magma Storm, so... Maybe not. And they can Terra still, right? Yeah. 20%. Wow. So this is going to eventually try to Drain and Kiss. But Mawa will beat it, right? Should I go Heatran? Yeah, they Drain and Kiss. Okay, I figured. Now you either want a Psychic or... Oh, it's Terra Water. They're not attacking here. Okay, they did. Wow. But we lived, which is the important thing. Now can Thunder Punch. Should kill. There we go. And Heatran's still at full, which is the key against these other two. 34. That's not what I need. I'm going to Thunder Punch here because... You know, maybe I should actually switch around and waste their screen turns a bit. This is great. Yeah, I like this. Okay, not not when you're freezing me. You know, I'm starting to realize my plan would have been a lot more effective had they actually been in range of anything. It's okay, though. I'm still fine. Because I go you. I psychic. Okay, they encore me into that, which is okay. And I just have to not get hacked by either of these. So it's going to be Poltegeist first. Do I want a Psychic or Sack Zamazenta and keep this in case it outspeeds Celesteela? I mean, they're just going to Shadow Ball, right? Yeah, okay. Because, like, the thing is, Heatran may not be enough to beat Celesteela alone, so... Okay, so here's the thing. I have to hit Magma Storm. And I did. We are Okay, cool. Yep, and they try to Meteor Beam, and it's not going to be enough right there. So we pick up the win, and that's great.